back again. So I've gotten parts of it sewn together. I've gotten the interlining into the front pieces of the waistcoat. I've got the shoulder seams and also the side seams on the outside portion of it sewn. And I've also added the belts to the side seam so that when they come across, you can have your belt in the back. It's a little dark, but uh, hopefully you can see it. So now it's time for a little bit of a fit check. And so far it fits like a vest. Up on the top we're looking pretty good. Now this is gonna be a step collar, so I'll add those later. But I can already tell with just the slight overlap that I should have for my buttons, there is a little bit of adjustment that's gonna need to be done. I do have a lot of excess material in the back. And so, you know, on the sides it comes way out. Now we do have a 5.8 seam allowance on this, so that may change things just a little bit, but I'm actually gonna to have to take a couple of inches off. This is also why we always mock up our pattern. If you want it to be fitted perfectly, then I'm gonna to have to take a little bit from the back and from the sides in order to get that line right exactly where I want it. So what we're looking at right here with the amount that I'm gonna to have to take off, it looks like I'm probably gonna to have to remove about a good four inches around the waist. So I'll do a little bit of that work and then we'll come back again and see what it looks like. 